Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I want to talk about new release bags that are on my radar. It's not a wish list or anything, but I think these bags are super cute. I keep browsing them online and you know what I'm talking about. All the bags that I mentioned in this video will be linked in the description box below. So I hope you enjoyed this video and let's get started. So the first bag that is on my radar is this Coach Willow crossbody bag. So this one reminds me of Coach Cassie that I used to have. It has the same turn lock hardware and this one is um, just very simple. White leather, especially white leather. It's so pretty. Coach website does have different colors, but only 24S has this white leather color. So this kind of pebble leather is uh, very carefree and best type of leather, very durable. And I think the size is pretty good. When you see model wearing it, it's a decent size. It's seven by nine by three. So you'll be able to fit quite a bit and inside it's very roomy it looks like there is one slip pocket there and the zipper pocket and the inside looks like a micro suede i love this gold hardware and white leather combo i think it's beautiful and the chain is detachable as you can see and um, it comes with this tag i think it comes with a two strap because this this one is just white strap which seems like adjustable and it's pretty wide too. So it comes with the fabric strap and the leather strap, which is a plus for me because I don't really like the thick guitar strap look, you know? So yeah, I think this bag is super cute. It's 375. If you are new, you can get 10% off from 24S. If you look at Coach website, it's called Willow Saddlebag and it comes with four different colors that do not have white color but it has black blue pink orange the price is same as 24s this one it's exactly same and here is the mod shot of model wearing it and it has a back pocket and you know it's fairly roomy so i think this will be a great everyday crossbody bag if you want to carry just essentials so i love the fact that it has a back pocket I feel like this one is very classic of coach and very pretty. Yeah, I see myself wearing it a lot. Let me know what you guys think of this one. Next one is Bottega Veneta cassette bag. So this is a new release. So this also has um, intrazzato weaving pattern. This one kind of looks like the one that I have, you know, the mini look bag. But this one has a bigger, you know, weaving detail. It comes with a zipper, double zip, and with a gold hardware. And cross body strap is attached to the inside the hole here but it's also double loop uh, like the one that I have you know I've been loving wearing that bag strap looks very thin but it's very durable and it's fairly comfortable so I haven't had any issues with it and it looks like it's you know pretty deep and wide but look here it's five and a half by five and a half and 2.7 so I know that my phone would not fit because my phone is bigger than six inches. So this is fairly small. And if you have a big phone, I don't think your phone would fit in here. But you know, your wallets or, you know, small things, I think definitely would fit in there. Look at how model's wearing it. It looks kind of big, right? More than five and a half. So I really want to see this one in person because I personally think this will be really cute. And I love this green color. And it comes with you know many different colors it comes with red white pink black so black also looks very classic and very pretty and this one also comes in a bigger size same style big weaving detail so eight by five and a half by almost three so this one is much bigger and it comes with three colors beige and purple and the black and it's also more expensive, like 2100 But if you think that the other side is too small, this one might work for you. And when you see Mata wearing it, you can see it's pretty big. Drip drop is only 19.6. Yeah, I think it's great for as a shoulder, but maybe for a crossbody, it might be a little too short. But this is a bigger size. And the other bag that I thought was super cute, this is another cassette. This one is a bucket bag style and i just love 
this detail of canvas with a leather trim combo if together it's so beautiful you guys it's a cotton and linen mix with the black leather you know this style comes in in many different colors i thought about it because the pricing is so good but this one is also very good i know it's not leather but 11.50 for Bottega is very good. The size 7 by 5 and a half by 5 and a half. The strap is also 19.6, so it's fairly short. This one has two straps, it looks like. Okay, so inside there is no lining, but it's just you can see the weaving detail in there, and then there is Bottega Venera in the middle. And when you see wearing model wearing it crossbody, it seems like it's a good length. That's 19.6 bottom. It looks like that exactly same i think this one is super cute it's pre-order right now as of now but this will be a perfect summer kind of easy going back and the size i think it's a decent size the price is good so yeah let me know what you guys think about this bag too next bag is ysl joe mini bucket bag so you know they have a big bucket one joe bag they came out with this tiny one and i think i saw mel from melbourne she had a vlog and she was trying this bag and i thought it was super cute it's very small but look how models wearing it i think this is very very cute in the back there's no pocket or anything there's a two holes and the straps kind of hanging from there and the size is seven and a half by five by five. So it's not very big, but bucket bag, because it's so wide at the bottom, you can put a lot more than you think. And it's got this front pocket. I think you can probably put some, you know, small wallets or receipts or cards if you like in there. So I think this bag is very cute. And I thought I was done with the chain bags, but when I saw this one, I was like, oh my gosh, super cute. The price is. 1790 it is pretty high for a mini bag yeah it is a little pricey but considering this is all leather lambskin right with the chain maybe the pricing is not too bad the other one is ysl victor baby clutch this comes in white and black this one is kind of like um clutch you know with the chain i just love this quilted detail with a very small logo very elegant looking with the gold hardware right and in the back there's no pocket or anything but this one is magnetic closure so you kind of have to open it from the middle and it you know snaps in when you see model wearing it i think it's very cute it's nine by seven by two and it's made with lambskin i think the strap length is short so i think you can only wear it as a shoulder bag but i thought that this will be a great you know wedding or special occasion bag what do you guys think next one is Fendi cookie bag so when i first saw this bag i thought it looked kind of weird but the more i look at it the more I like it. I don't know. It's very cute. It looks very structured. It's made with Fendi canvas and logo all over, and it's got big logo in the middle. Strap looks kind of skinny and small, but when you see model wearing it, it looks like this. I think this bag is very cute and the priced really well. Look, one thousand five hundred ninety for Fendi. That's not a bad price, right? And let's look at the size. It's almost eight. 8 width by 5 by 1.2 so it's very skinny bag it's pretty wide but because the depth is so skinny i don't think you can put a lot and there is a middle flap closure but because side is open i mean you're not gonna be able to fit anything in right here right this logo in the middle looks very good and inside looks like a micro suede and there's a fendi logo right there and looks like magnetic closure i just feel like this bag will be a great special occasion bag maybe um it's fairly small and skinny so you cannot put a lot but it's kind of like statement bag right and as you can see low stock and this was out of stock in fendi website so i think for the price this bag will be a very good piece if you want to own something for Fendi, because other Fendi bags, bag out and other bag, Picapoo bags, they're all over $3,000. So, you know, you want something Fendi, I think this would be a good option. 
Last but not least, this is actually a wallet, um, Dior Caro Extra Small Wallet. It's a basic like flap style wallet, but look, the thing I like about this wallet is it's got zipper inside. So you can put coins and other things that you want to be secure, you can put it here. And it's two car slots in the back and then middle compartment. I used to have your car holder, oblique one, but I ended up selling that one because it was a little too bulky and did not have any zipper. So my coins will all fall out when I open it, you know, but this one does have a zipper inside and it's pretty spacious inside so i think you can put quite a bit of cards cash or whatever you want to in there so it's the front and the back there is i don't think there's any back pocket on this one and the size is four and a half by three by one so i think the size is very similar to the dior flap car holder i used to have so yeah the size is very similar it still comes in black and i personally like the black color the best it also comes in a pink, which I think is very pretty. So if you want some kind of accent wallet, I think this color is great too. And in the back, there is no pocket. Yeah. But what do you guys think? I think this is a, like a leather wallet, right? Car holder, but it's $560 Dior. Um, not a bad price. And I heard Dior is doing another price increase. I heard the rumor. So I really like this wallet too. So you might see this in my future so what do you guys think i feel like these bags are well priced considering the brand name and the style let me know what you guys think of these bags in the comments below thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you next time